All right. So I back drilled this whole row. Pardon my other iPad there with my show on it. And I'll show you just how easy this is. Perfect. 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 Look at that. All right, so those are all out nice and clean. Now, I don't usually do this, but here's the deal. I'm an AMP. I'm not a sheet metal person by, by schooling or trade, if you will. But because I was willing to risk failing and put myself out there a bunch of years ago, I started volunteering for all the sheet metal jobs because no one else at the company I worked for wanted to do it. And to be honest, a lot of them that tried did it really, really, really poorly. So I liked woodworking, so I started learning uh, more than what I had been taught in the past and I started buying tools that that made it easier and more efficient and I stick to the basics every time I get in a bind and I I'm, I'm human I get in a bind there are times where I'll, I'll get to a point where I just won't, won't know what to do and then I stop I get with someone that knows more than I do, usually a guy named Scott Cam, who I've worked with a lot at uh, Masaba, or I'll reach out to almost anyone for more information. Everyone, well, I shouldn't say everyone, a lot of people are going to look at this video and say, oh my God, that's easy, anyone can do that, that's stupid. It's not stupid. It's not easy and not everyone can do this I have followed people so many times so many times that just F this up so bad and I get it they're they're under trained or they don't care or their main emphasis isn't to protect the base metal they just hurry up they get in there they try to rip them out and the next thing you know, you have number four holes that are now number eights. They're figure eights, they're snowmen, they're, they're, it's just horrible. And most times they had the time and sometimes they had the tools and they still screwed it all up. So before you make a reply and say, oh, that's stupid, anyone can do that. It's been in my career Many, many, many people don't know these simple basics. And if you just learn these basics, you can do really good sheet metal work. Um, anyhow, that's all I got. I just want to, you know, save my blood pressure and, and, and somebody that thinks they know it all, 10 seconds of typing. Don't even bother telling me how easy this is. For me, it's fairly easy. And once in a great while, I'll still screw up a hole. Um, but I spent probably two decades learning how to do this myself predominantly with help from some really, really, really good people. Um, so, step at a time. Anyway, we'll get back with it.